Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Virgo, June 9, 2022. Saturn stations and turns retrograde today, and will move in this apparent backward motion until October 23rd. While this shift occurs, especially the day after Mercury station, watch for errors or blurred perceptions. Strained relationships or the weight of your work or health responsibilities can be heavier temporarily. However, the cycle itself simply points to a shifting perspective on your routines, work, health, or romantic and creative life. It's a better period for review and reflection than innovation. While you may encounter some waning motivation or delays in any of these areas, you are in an excellent position to simplify, edit, and build what you already have in place. You might reassess commitments to specific programs, projects, or jobs. Today's planetary configuration brings a lot of good ideas into the sphere of your relationship. You may have some wonderful plans to reform it, and yourselves. You would, however, prefer to see it transformed according to your personal expectations, with an outcome that matches your very specific agenda. To get the best, you need to let the relationship to flow naturally. If you hang on to anything, you'll lose it. How do you consider your job, work environment, and routine? Although you may have a better idea about your career now that Mercury is direct, you may feel unsure of the restrictions in your daily work life now that Saturn has stationed retrograde in Aquarius. How you value your time and energy will be important throughout this retrograde. You may learn difficult lessons in boundaries, especially if you are too available to work, which can cause burnout. Saturn retrograde may encourage you to be more confident in the unique aspects of your job too. As Saturn turns retrograde in your work sector today this might be slowing things down on the job front but will also anchor them. With the moon returning to your income sector in next week and the sun creating insight and stability on the career front, there is reason for confidence. While income potential is more low-key than money matters it has the backing of the professional gods. You are in a state of siege in your own home and in your family circle. People are criticizing you constantly and you feel you're doing everything wrong. Take time to reflect before retorting, because they could actually be right on some points. If you react in a sober way, your family will regain their trust in you very quickly. Don't knock your emotions and passionate outlook. Those qualities are responsible for some of the most amazing events in your life. Just make sure you balance that volatility with a touch of discretion. You find the idea of meeting new people difficult, not really something you want to contemplate, if this is actually how you feel, then far better to wait a while and reflect on what you really want to achieve. When this is done, the idea of dating has a realistic purpose with much higher chances for success. Your feelings will guide you if you will let them. There is a temptation to go the route that will win the most approval, but it would be in your best interest to start opening up to approval from within. Getting to do what you want is an option you give yourself, it has nothing to do with outside approval. Thus, consider your body and how you feel in it today. Is there some nagging health issue that you wish were not there? Begin by addressing your problem areas. It's the perfect day to get some work done. When a vibration is occurring, you're sure to notice a stronger sense of duty and dedication to getting the job done and done well. Let this work to your advantage. Make that to-do list and start checking things off one by one. It's not likely that anything will distract you. When all is said and done, you can sit back and relax this evening knowing that you put in an excellent day. While the moon's return to your income sector today kicks off what could be an insightful and empowering few days across the income, work and career fronts, it comes just as Venus moves into her final two weeks in an adventurous part of your chart. Knowing that her return to your career sector in 14 days will contribute to the growing professional momentum, creates even more determination to ensure life doesn't become all work and no play. The last thing that the moon will do before leaving Virgo is form a friendly aspect to Pluto, in retrograde motion in your romantic sector and the timing couldn't be better. This comes just as Venus, the planet of love moves into her final two weeks in an adventurous part of your chart, 
with the moon adding fuel to a mix of romance, adventure, and nostalgia. Our Eyes in the Sky As the moon spends its last hours in attention-seeking Virgo today, this is your last chance to make it all about you. This fiery emotional lunar combo loves to make you the center of everything, so even if you're shy at heart, you might actually enjoy being in the spotlight a little more than usual now. And since all eyes will be on you, why not look your best? This is prime primping energy, so make those hair and money petty appointments ASAP. Clothes shopping is fun now too, as is taking more selfies from more fantastic angles than seem humanly possible. Although there's no social media posting limit, maybe there should be. No matter how good you look, people might be tired of seeing you live your best life by the time the day is over. But overall, not a bad problem to have. There's not a whole lot to complain about today unless you're looking extra hard for it. In the morning, the Virgo moon trines Uranus in Taurus, stimulating our intuition. The day ahead forecasts significant twists and turns, when riding the wave will make us magnets for serendipity. Although surprises and shakeups serve to release us from self-imposed limitations, the trine is also what is considered an easy aspect. This means that we can miss its most constructive effects if we are content to stay in the house. We don't have to go out of our way to use this influence to our full advantage. Try taking a different road to work, sampling a new cuisine, or volunteering to teach someone a skill you've cultivated. In the process, we'll place ourselves just enough outside our comfort zone, communicating to the universe our interest in an upgrade. Shortly following this, the moon squares off with the Gemini sun, prompting us to review events that have transpired since the May 30th Gemini new moon. Intentions were set for manifesting social connections that could aid us in sharing our voices within our communities. We might have begun ventures dealing explicitly with the spoken or written word, or undertaken research or investigative projects. Yet, now we find ourselves faced with adversity. Perhaps we are grappling with self-doubt. Or perhaps we are experiencing conflict with someone who has called our intelligence into question. If we adopt a know-it-all approach, we deny ourselves the opportunity to grow in our field of expertise. Remember, we are here to learn. Learning requires us to update our opinions when faced with new evidence. Don't deny yourself the chance for further self-development. We'll choose to express ourselves with acts of kindness and service to those we care about, who will then see our truest heart. Our need for variety can place us in situations where romantic engagements take a back seat. Ordinarily, asking for space won't be a problem here. It is more likely that issues will arise if we make our needs known improperly or fail to consider someone else's needs. The reverse may also be true, we feel neglected in some capacity by another, which makes us go looking for love in all the wrong places.